YouTube, every single person except anyone who hasn't hit the subscribe button before. It's right down there and it's free. I'm annoying, but honestly, you should do it. Welcome to a video. I am not gonna even lie. I was fully, fully inspired by Miss Emma Chamberlain herself, the queen of YouTube. Emma recently did a video called Making Ugly Clothes Cute. I've always liked DIYs, but I'm not a sewer. I can't do that shit. I need something easy, like just upcycling or just, just easy ones. <laughs> Oh my god, a few months ago in a vlog, I showed that I bought these for TK and I to like make a DIY with and have we yet? No, not at all. I also bought these chains from Amazon, honestly almost a year ago now, but at this point, because I wanted to do like a DIY sneaker thing with them and I figured, you know what? Why not just freaking do it? This isn't meant to be a tutorial, it's just meant to see if we can actually get some cuter clothes out of the stuff that I was planning on donating slash giving away anyway before they leave the house. I was like, yo, let's try to, you know. Revive them. I know which one I'm gonna do first because I'm most confident in this one. If you've watched my channel for a while, you will recognize this very worn in t shirt. I believe this is from a store that is not um, that inclusive, so we're not even gonna shout them out. But, <laughs> period. I've been seeing this trend lately where you cut down the middle of it. Is this centered? This is my problem. This is why I'm not a DIYer because I get too lazy. I don't measure shit. I'm just like, let's eye it. Oh my God. Wait, I feel like this is gonna be cute. Okay, so now I have like an open little vest dealio thing. I got these like oversized safety pin things, which are really cool. They're from Amazon. I'll have my affiliate link down below for you guys. They were super inexpensive. And on top of it, you had the option of getting silver or black. And I felt like the black was just so much more elevated. So I'm just gonna kind of pin them. Oh my God, this is cute. Fuck yeah. Right. Who's your favorite YouTuber to watch right now? I have a talent where I find really small YouTubers and I just become obsessed with them. I've low-key been obsessed with this really small YouTuber named Michael Mako. He has such an eye for vlogging. He has like 4,000 subscribers. Guys. <laughs> she keeps sending me his I vlogs. I keep sending She's like, you. no, wait, but watch this one. <laughs> I, I keep sending you and Ollie vlogs. I'm like, watch this one. It's so good. I'm obsessed with him, but like keep it low-key, guys, okay? Don't make me look like a fangirl. <laughs> I feel like there's the obvious ones like James. Yeah, his videos have been lit lately. Oh, his house? <laughs> I'm like, damn, I want a freaking trampoline in my grass. I <laughs> know. Have you been on any dates lately? <laughs> no. Did you DM who I told you to yesterday? No, I didn't. Should we do that right yes. now? Yes. Or should I say, hey, wanna collab? Or like, so when are we gonna make TikToks together? Yeah, yeah, yeah. She's confident. <laughs> That's super cute. Wait, it's so much cuter. I feel like I should like fray this a little bit. Okay, now I'm just kind of making some like slits in the collar if anyone cares to know. <laughs> this is also where I go wrong sometimes though. Like it's fine and then I ruin it. Yeah, I think we should stop at that. Yeah, uh, yeah. <laughs> yes, we should. Oh, edgy. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Alicia Marie. It just needs to look cute. Okay. Here it is. Really fucking cute. I'm not shocked, but I'm like. It looks like it's from LF. Oh my God, this is such LF vibes. Do you remember when that was like the, the biggest thing? Oh. I've had this shirt for so long and I love that now I wanna keep it. Like I'm gonna keep this. I'm thinking of how many times I've bought a shirt like this and they've charged me $120. Yeah, it's so dumb. I'm an idiot. these shoes they literally look brand new and i'm not kidding you guys they were so disgusting when i did the wop dance i wore them and they got mud all over them it was to the point where i almost threw them out and i'm so glad i just threw them in the washing machine because they are so crisp white now like i mentioned i bought these chains from amazon forever ago they were so inexpensive again link below if you want them the reason why i bought these was because i saw a collab that nike did with comme de garcons i'm totally probably saying that wrong and these air max shoes i believe were like 500 dollars. they were so expensive i even contemplated getting them because i loved them so much and i was like alicia literally buy some freaking necklaces and diy this you can do it. I figured now is the perfect time. Okay, I'm essentially just like sewing these chains in. Cute! Oh my god, so cute. Fuck me Wait, up. Wait, will you? I think we're getting somewhere. Oh my god, it looks so sick. My old deal, DIY self is shook. Oh. oh, I hope you can come off. You'll be so dope if you can. This is surgery, everyone. Damn, Amazon, you made some strong chain. Oh, there we go. There we go. <gasps> there we go. Holy shit, it's happening. Oh, what? Oh my God, I may actually be a fashion designer, guys. 
I think these might be my new favorite shoes. I honestly had no plan with this one. I was like, let's just try to sew these chains into the laces and it completely worked out. I wish I could give you more guidance than just kind of go with the flow. Lord DIY, am I coming for your brand? <laughs> if you want real DIY tutorials, go watch Lauren's videos. I love these. I just, I feel like people may compliment me when I wear them. I love how these turned out. Okay, this is one that I saw on TikTok. I have this just like plain green shirt that I feel like we could spice up a little bit. It's kind of similar to the other one, so feeling confident in that side, but it's actually really cute. So you're just gonna cut it down the middle again. And then when you wear it, you kind of do like a little twisty guy. Or it looks something like that. Okay, I'm not gonna lie when I tell you, I was like, this one is so basic. I love this one. Like this is something I will literally wear. And I feel like it's the easiest one out of all of them too, because you literally just cut it and tie it. So I think I'm gonna do this to like five more of my shirts because it's just cute. Oh my God, or you could have it open. <laughs> got this skirt and it's way too small to get over my butt so that's fun <laughs> it's gonna be a really bad idea i was thinking it could be a really cute strapless top mm -hmm. if i just cut it and then what if even like this was the halter like <laughs> cute right do you have your notifications on no okay i just want to see if he dm'd you back oh it says seam <laughs> How long ago? It doesn't say when they seen it, right? Shit. Oh, shit. Okay, we, you know what? Oh, okay. <laughs> Ballsy as fork. No, I'm, I'm just gonna put it over. Oh, shit. I don't think this would ever work as a top. Well, actually, hold on. <gasps> Maybe. <gasps> Wait, oh my god. Wait, why is it low key a little cute? Oh, no. No, no. No? No, no, no. Oh, no. Yeah. Hi. Does it look like a shirt? Cool girl, Alicia. Does it look like a shirt? Yeah. Like you could totally fool people. Oh yeah, from these photos you would literally think. Yeah. Anyways, this was a fail. Forget it ever happened. So here is the next victim that I'm gonna try to attempt to make cuter. This is just a Hanes normal long sleeve t-shirt. I don't need to explain that. So here's the before. I think I got it in like a random like Christmas PJ packaging thing. I'm gonna attempt to make this an infinity scarf shirt, infinity shirt, infinity crop top. We'll see what it turns out to be. So let's cut it. Cut it. I saw a tutorial on this and I'm kind of too lazy to look it up again, but we're just gonna cut the bottom of this oversized tee. Oh, shut the f up. What? <laughs> I'm sorry, what the for? <laughs> Great. Okay, so I realized I totally didn't actually show you guys how to do this. So basically, when you have your shirt, you're going to cut off the bottom half. So give yourself enough fabric there. Then once you take that off, you have this little circle thing. Then put that on. And before you put it over your neck, twist it. And you get something like this. Iconic, right? You, I mean, I'm not going to lie. This, this is a little tight. It looks like a revolve. I, I could tell you this was... Oh my God, ask, me how, ask me where I got this. I love your shirt. Where did you get it? Um, it's from Revolve. I'm part of their influencer program. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I hated that. <laughs> Hot. This is definitely the best one. You should wear this out. I will. It is a little tight. I think, let me see what size this was. Okay, so this is a medium. And it's a little tight on me. I could easily still wear this out. Like, it's yeah. just a little. Tight? Little tight. I love it. I love it. <laughs> Honestly, this entire video has taught me that I am, I think I'm a fashion designer. Wow, Alicia Marie Designs. Alicia Marie Fashion Designer. Let me know which one of these was your favorite if you want more videos like this and a little BTS of filming going on right now. Um, if you guys want to subscribe to the vlog channel, then freaking do it. And if the vlog viewers saw this and now you're seeing this, you're Inception. like, you're fucking dope. Like, you real, you're, you're great. <laughs>